Bienvenidos a la clase de español. Welcome to Spanish class. Okay, niños. Okay, boys and girls. Last week, we looked at how to tell the time in Spanish. So, yes, we answered the question. ¿Qué hora es? What time is it? ¿Qué hora es? What time is it? Now, this week, we're going to do a little revision based on what we learned uh, last week. First, before we answer the question, we said that we need to be reminded about the numbers in Spanish. So let's say the number is 1 to 30. Even though we said that for last week and this week, our focus is on the numbers 1 to 12. So let's say the numbers. Uno, dos, tres, Cuatro, cinco, seis, siete, ocho, nueve, diez, once, doce, trece, catorce, quince, dieciséis, diecisiete, dieciocho, Diecinueve, veinte, veintiuno, veintidós, veintitrés, veinticuatro, veinticinco, veintiséis, veintisiete, veintiocho, veintinueve, treinta. All right? Now, what did we see? We said that there are two ways for telling the time on the hour. If we're saying that it is one o'clock, we say es la una. So we only say es la una when it is one o'clock. Es la una. It is one o'clock. So the only time. We're going to be saying or telling the time using es la una is when it is one o'clock. For all other times, such as two o'clock to twelve o'clock, any time from two o'clock to twelve o'clock, first we say son las, then the number in Spanish to tell the time, the number that represents the time on the clock. So what do we mean by this? So, for example, if it is two o'clock, first we say son las, then the Spanish for the number two. So, for two o'clock, we say son las dos. What if it is three o'clock? What would we say? Son las tres. Four o'clock. What do we say in Spanish? Son las cuatro. Excelente. Yes, I know you're smart, you got it. Yes, so what if it is five o'clock? What would you say in Spanish? Son las cinco. Excelente, son las cinco. What about six o'clock? Son las seis. Perfecto. What if it is seven o'clock? Yes, see. Sí. Son las siete. So remember, we say son las. Then the number that represents the time on the clock, if we're telling the time from two to twelve o'clock. However, as we said, if it is one o'clock, you would say es la una, because the only time you use es la una is to say that it is one o'clock. Now, I'm going to sing a little song, and then I want you to play this video over and over. Practice singing the song, tell us a little tune, so that you can remember the time. All right? Que hora es? What time is it? Que hora es? What time is it? Es la una. It is one o'clock. 
It's la una. It is one o'clock. Que hora es? What time is it? Que hora es? What time is it? Son las dos. It is two o'clock. Son las dos. It is two o'clock. Que hora es? What time is it? Que hora es? What time is it? Son las tres. It is three o'clock. Son las tres. It is three o'clock. Que hora es? What time is it? Que hora es? What time is it? Son las cuatro. It is four o'clock. Son las cuatro. It is four o'clock. Que hora es? What time is it? Que hora es? What time is it? Son las cinco. It is five o'clock. Son las cinco. It is five o'clock. Que hora es? What time is it? Que hora es? What time is it? Son las seis. It is six o'clock. Son las seis. It is six o'clock. Que hora es? What time is it? Que hora es? What time is it? Son las siete. It is seven o'clock. Son las siete. It is seven o'clock. Que hora es? What time is it? Que hora es? What time is it? Son las ocho. It is eight o'clock. Son las ocho. It is eight o'clock. Que hora es? What time is it? Que hora es? What time is it? Son las nueve. It is nine o'clock. Son las nueve. It is nine o'clock. Que hora es? What time is it? Que hora es? What time is it? Son las diez. It is ten o'clock. Son las diez. It is ten o'clock. Que hora es? What time is it? Que hora es? What time is it? Son las once. It is eleven o'clock. Son las once. It is eleven o'clock. Que hora es? What time is it? Que hora es? What time is it? Son las doce. It is twelve o'clock. Son las doce. It is twelve o'clock. So boys and girls, I want you to practice spelling the time in Spanish. I've shared two materials in the Spanish Google Classroom. Two additional ones. One is a PowerPoint presentation that reminds us about how to tell the time you may read through and continue doing some more practice. And also I've shared your classwork activity for this week. So I want you to complete that, those activities. All right, continue um, to practice telling the time students. Adios.